We just got these in. Well, we got them in a while back. We just haven't put them up. We're gonna try them out in two rooms. And these are 36 by, uh, by 64. They're going in the bedrooms. And we're gonna see how they look. Let me show you before. This is before. Now there's a lot of yellowing because this used to be bright white. And as time went on, the sun just completely yellowed these out. So we're gonna put, uh, we're gonna see what a difference they are from uh, the ones we purchased. We're gonna see, I'm not sure if they're the same or they, I think they're similar. This is another one we're replacing. Again, it's just yellowed, yellow, yellow. And it's already broken there, so we gotta replace it. Um, and this window, see how it looks. So I think these are these that we purchased uh, for these windows. And they seem to be the same ones that I purchased for this window and a couple of other windows. It would be nice if the ones on the window right now have the same hardware so I don't have to replace them, but I'll do what I have to do. And uh, this is information on the actual uh, information, manual, instructions. So that's this. And got the screws here. And then these things. Not very difficult uh, to do. Since I've done it already, the same sack hardware that came with the other ones. So. Just in case you lost your instructions, you can pause the video here and just read these words. I've already read these and uh, I know what I have to do. I usually get a, uh, I pre-drill a hole before screwing in the screws because the wood frames, um, the wood frames are on my windows, uh, 1930 wood frame, I believe 1930 wood frame, and uh, I don't want to crack the wood, uh, so pre-drill a hole. you won't have any issues with cracking if you have wood frames. These are the tools I'm gonna to be using. I'll be making holes uh, with, the, uh, with my screwdriver, my electric uh, Milwaukee screwdriver. Uh, with a drill bit, a small one. I don't know what size that is. I just grabbed the smallest one. And then uh, Phillips screwdriver. I'll be using the handheld to screw in the screw since I don't need that much. Once I make the hole, I won't need that much force to screw it in. And it's... Uh, yeah. Okay, 
Okay, they're not the same ones as those. They're the same ones as the ones that are there now. But you see how much wider they are now? Now those are over 10 years old or longer or older. So hopefully we can get another 10 years out of these. But they are definitely, it looks like they're the same ones. Okay, let's put it up. Hopefully it's the same hardware. Since it's the same thing, I won't need to change anything out. It looks like it's different hardware. So we probably will be replacing the hardware. Let me see. Hardware doesn't fit. I tried, but it's not gonna fit. So I'm gonna have to switch it out. But I'm gonna screw in the old ones in the same location, because it has the same two set of screws underneath there. Uh, right there. So that was the old hardware. Again, it's been up there more than 10 years. Now replacing it with the new ones. So I believe this is the way they go. Like that. As you see, that's going to be the front. This is going to be the back so you don't see it. The clips are behind here. When you take this out, pretty much sort of like this. When you take the other one, this goes on the inside here within the opening. And bring it. See that right there. See that? To there. And then you snap it in place. So once you mounted these to the uh, window, that's how they should clip. So I can't remove this one with one hand. So I already had the holes pre-drilled, so I didn't need to pre-drill any holes, and I put them up. Perfect, look at that. Those are all other holes from other things. We gotta fix those things, but for now, we're just putting up the shade to keep uh, people from peeking in. These windows are gonna get redone, so we haven't really taken any opportunity to fix them at all because they're supposed to change out the windows in where I live. We're waiting for that. I don't see anything in the instructions, except for where you mount the brackets, which is, this is uh, for outside mounting. I'm not doing that, I'm doing the inside. That's where the screws are going up and the bracket is mostly on the inside of the frame of the window. Uh, as we go, in regards to front and back, I don't see, let me look, anything saying front or back. at all and then if you look at the shade itself it doesn't really have as you can see it's in the center so i think it doesn't matter but if you know better let me know i'll correct it because i could unsnap it and flip it around if anything it should be really easy so i screwed in that one and uh this one and If it will go something like this. Uh, this will fit on the inside. See the in, it will go on the inside. And I hope I have enough inside. And then that will clip. Once I get that on the inside, that will clip on there. Okay, a mistake I just made, so you'll learn from my mistake and you won't do it. I didn't take into account those little slots right there. These uh, clear things right there. When putting these in, it doesn't fit. See that? And on the other side is the same thing. So I'm going to have to move this over maybe half an inch. So I'm about uh, three inches in. I have to go about, about, I'm sorry, one inch and a quarter in. An inch and a quarter go in and you should be fine in um, not having this thing in the way, this plastic thing. So make sure you do that. Hopefully you watched the video and you saw that. Be 
before you start installation. This will go on the inside. Uh, those clips will have to clip there on the inside. So let me see if I can do this with one hand. Again, this goes on the outside. This goes on the inside. And I put it in. And I push this back and it clips into place. Awesome. Find the center, clip this into place. It goes in behind and then you clip this up. So it hugs the back like this, like this, and then you just clip it. Perfect. And now this is what you use to go up and down. Now, I don't know if you can see it in the video, but it's a lot wider and a lot cleaner. It looks pretty nice. I got no complaints about it. I like it. It looks great, the shade. I hope that the video is doing it justice. Okay, let's do the other window. I'm going to just show you the end result of the next window. The last and final window, and it looks much better than it did. It had the big hole, if you remember before. No more hole. So it looks much better, much nicer, much cleaner. All information on the actual shades are below. Um, I hope you like the video. I hope it helps. Thank you for watching. Bye now.